An application to register a pest control product follows a series of steps. The purpose of your application determines the data and non-data elements required. Once that has been identified, you may request a pre-submission consultation to better understand the data requirements and obtain written guidance. A pre-submission consultation is not always required except for joint reviews and microbial applications. Once your application package is complete, visit the PMRA website to obtain directions on how to compile the data package into PRZ format. Then you can submit it through the Secure Electronic Pesticide Regulatory System by mail or email. The system will then set up the submission on a first come, first served basis and assign a submission number. Your submission will be verified and screened to ensure the package is complete before the science review begins. The verification process ensures that all non-data elements have been provided. During the screening process, submissions are reviewed to confirm the category of submission and ensure it meets the format, data, fee requirements, and that the labels follow current guidelines and directives. You may receive clarification requests by email and you will have 10 calendar days to respond. If deficiencies or insufficient information are identified, a notice of deficiencies will be issued and you will have 45 calendar days to respond. If there is no response or an incomplete response is received, the application will be refused. In the science review stage, a team of scientists evaluate the health and environmental risks as well as the value of the pesticide to determine if they are acceptable. Just like in the screening process, you will have 10 calendar days to respond to clarification requests. If deficiencies are identified, you will receive a notice of deficiencies and have 90 calendar days to fulfill the outlined requirements. It should be noted that the science review is suspended until a response is received. Once the rigorous science-based evaluation is complete, the findings of the science review teams undergo peer review and manager approval. Then, all assessment results and science team recommendations are consolidated. For new active ingredients or major new uses, these are presented to PMRA's Science Operations Committee for discussion and then to Science Management Committee for decision. At the end of the review stage, the bilingual revised labels are sent to applicants by email to provide an opportunity to comment and to clarify issues arising from the revisions. A bilingual consultation document is published on the Health Canada website for all major decisions, which outline major findings and the proposed decision. The public may submit comments on the consultation document to the PMRA within 45 days after its publication. All comments received from the consultation period are considered before a final decision is made. The final decisions are posted on the Health Canada website. Anyone can access information about registered pesticides through the public registry. It is a collection of non-confidential and publicly available information for currently registered pesticides. For more information and guidance on how to register pesticides, contact the Pest Management Information Service or visit canada.ca slash pesticides. A message from the Government of Canada.